right, this is how we're gonna do things? Yeah. Yay! Alright. Alright, what the hell am I gonna do here? I probably should have figured this out ahead of time, but I wanted to improvise. Okay. Battle Network, that's pretty basic. Yes, handle me zooming in decently. Uh, not really. Uh, eh, kind of. Alright. Alright. So, here, what am I gonna do? I don't like using these brush tools. Like, no. Oh, my stuff looks so weird, is that it's got like this pretty blocky, like, kids coloring book look to it. Sure, why not? Let's draw a land car. Yeah, you know, that's your head. Let's start over here. Yeah. That goofy ass spiky. Yeah, because hair totally does that. Yeah, fine. Let's do it's now Super Saiyan 3 land. Why the hell not? Or punk rock Hikari, I'm not sure. That goofy little battle network logo thing. It's also Mega Man symbol. Alley oop. Okay, you have way too round a head. Let's fix that. Let's get a big fucking bite out of it. No, that's not. That's not. I'm gonna say bite. Let's be literal here. Chomp, 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 chomp. I'm not even gonna ask what kind of creature makes that kind of bite. What kind of jaw is this right here? It's like, ugh, I have no. I have a jaw that just goes at like a 45 degree angle suddenly. Okay, so let's take a bite out of crime. Of net, take a bite out of net crime. Yeah. Okay, let's give you a big honking butt chin. And that looks more like testicles, but that's fine. No, it's not. It looks terrible. Um, what am I kidding? This always looks terrible. And people love it, and I don't know why. Okay, let's add... Sure, let's just have a big, beefy arm. That's kind of what this looks like. I stress kinda. Oh, yeah. So f fucking manly. Yes. Just like this. Yes. Power thirst! Uh, fine, I cannot draw hands. Nobody can. Fine, let's give you a thumb. A index finger. Now, it's worth noting, I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I do all these stupid drawings uh, with an optical mouse on my mattress while I use my laptop, so these have an interesting tendency to just, like, flail around, like what you get right there. Where is your pinky? What is your pinky? It's a Christmas tree. Or Yeah, that's totally a Christmas tree. What are you talking about? That's a Christmas tree that grows the other direction. Uh, this is what happens when you have no sense of artistic anything and people encourage you all the same. Okay, that's insane. Roots. See, th there's kind of a counterintuitive problem in that I have gotten less horrible over the years of doing this, so it's like, oh, I can't get that same magical sense of just total shit that I used to. Uh, yeah, sure, let's go for the little, like, arachnid limb thing going on here, because that's totally, that's terrifying. Okay, some kind of, like, praying mantis, what's it? Rawr! That's... I have no idea what. What are you going to be? My solution to this problem is always just draw things and... I meant to draw like kind of a heart shit, like the pulsating heart organ thing, but... It came out looking more like an ass. Wonderful. Yeah, 
costume looks horrible in every possible way. Could be. Alright, fine. Let's give you eyes. Uh, what kind of eyeballs do you have? Uh, the protruding kind. Let's take a bite out of the bite. There's one. Oh god, why do you have a... Oh, god, it looks like a sperm cell. Jesus Christ, he's like a fucking snail. Okay, that's... <laughs> oh, God. What have, what have I done? Alright, um... Mouth. What kind of mouth do snails have? I don't know, but it's like some kind of... filter feeder thing going on here. Oh, Jesus Christ, you're terrifying! Why do you exist? Why did I give you life? Pull you forth from the horrid vacuum of terrible shit. My brain just erupts with vomit. Neurological vomit, that's what you are. Accept me, daddy. Things because that's just kind of a thing I seem to do. Jesus Christ. Um, okay, pupils. That's actually a lot more terrifying without them. It's, uh, I don't like that. Okay, that's just. Rawr. Okay, there. You look more cartoony than nightmares. That's an improvement, I think. Ah, uh, crap, I don't have any color references. Usually I just put little color things in here. Uh... Crap, okay, fine. We'll, we'll have to improvise. Don't have the exact colors. Probably could if I looked them up, but I don't feel like doing that right now. There's your hair. Uh, he looks like a freaking... Looks like a punk rocker now. Let's go more Super Saiyan. Yeah, that's better. Let's see. Mega Man Blue. Shade. That's pretty close. There you go. Get the red. A darker shade. A little less saturated. Perfect. Yeah, that's totally. The icon of the series that I've played for like 10 goddamn years. No, more than that, the first one came out in uh, 2001 in the US, so let's see here. Okay, might as well use that Battle Network color for the inside of your mouth. There you go, that's not the thing. What do you exist with there? Okay. Yeah. Okay. And those are just like. Flesh. A fleshy color. And pinker, the, the, a little more like that. Ah, no, let's make it a little more green. Why not? There we go. Oh, that's disgusting. It looks like rotten butter or something. Some horrible, like, food coloring state, like, margarine product. Somebody puked in, apparently. Oh, that, that is a horrible color. Like elastic, fleshy thing. Oh, let's get rid of it. Yeah, that looks even more horrifying. Perfect. Just that it's not like there's an inner and outer. It's just this stretched mouth flap that's segmented. Oh, this is just how my 
train of thought works, I suppose. Uh, teeth colors, teeth colors, uh, just uh, default orange. I don't think that was supposed to be a tooth. I don't remember what I said it would be. I'm very easily distracted. Yeah, that's totally... These are totally teeth! What are you talking about? It's like he's growing candy corn! Yeah, this stuff down here. Okay. Segment off the, the more like, inset rather than the yep. There, that gets more. Okay, what color do I want this to be? Let's take eye destroying pink and desaturate this. Good enough. Uh, yeah, you've got... It's not a purple heart, but you fought well. Let's see here. Uh, yeah. Insect stuff can just be this horrible... green, aqua, radioactive color. <sighs> it looks like... Why does it look like Easter? Oh god. Fine, fine. Easter is in the... yeah. Let's get some, uh... Or yellowy thing in there. It's kind of like marshmallow peep color. You ever done, uh, Peeps Jousting? I remember reading it on just, like, some Sprite comic from, like, 2004. Oh, probably earlier, more like 2003. And, uh, what you do is you put... You take those horrible marshmallow peeps that nobody actually wants to eat, you stick them in the microwave, and here, I'll just draw it out. This is totally a microwave. What are you talking about? That's like a platter. Then you take, like, the marshmallow peep on one side. Fine. Ducks. Why not? Take the... Fucking hell, I drew them too close together. Go over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you take your horrible marshmallow peeps and you stick them in the microwave. I have a segmented microwave, what are you talking about? Then what you do is you stick toothpicks in each of them, like so, and then once you turn the microwave on, just set it for like 30 seconds tops. Uh, the microwaves go in to the peeps, and because there are marshmallows, they will start to inflate. They'll just get really huge, fat, and just swollen, bloated peep abominations. And just one of them will eventually pop the other with their toothpick, and the one that deflates is the loser. That is peeps jousting. Made especially exciting if you have a, if you just make the plate rotate that they're on. I don't know what that was supposed to be. Um, uh, this horrible flesh color. Let's start with that, and then desaturate, make it a bit more yellow, and darken. Yeah, let's make it a more vomit color. More like this dark puke. Perfect. There we go. Ugh, that is a truly hideous color there. It actually does look like a plump prey mantis kind of horrible mutant organic green. Okay, uh, what else am I gonna do here? Oh yeah, you kind of need a body, don't you? You're just like a head with a testicle chin and giant arm that turns into this mess. Okay. Um, how's my, how am I doing for time? Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know where to build the rest of it off. Oh, fine, let's... You're like a caterpillar. Let's build this out of your hair. Um, yeah, he is very hungry. That's true. Okay. Eric Carl, eat your heart out. Let's see. Uh, uh, that's horrible in every possible way it could be. Uh, 
Okay, what am I gonna do with you? Let's start with these two segments. Oh, just, I think we're way, way too round, but let's just leave them as like the bounded space and draw within that. That'll do. Hmm. Okay, so if I'm starting with a caterpillar, what do I draw for the, the thorax? Um. Ah. Okay, let's start with just like mini segments going off the body. Just like that. This is a kind of a decent start. Very interesting definition of decent I have. Drawing just deformed, squashed semicircles. This is yeah, this this is what everybody would call decent and not god awful. Okay. Delete and let's say behind this. You know what you need? You need like some kind of yeah, you've got the Super Saiyan here. You need, let's make this a, like a life aura sort of thing. To this, like... Okay, that's the darker, buttery yellow shade. No, it needs to be a little more saturated than that kind of powder thing. A little darker. Perfect. Mm -hmm. yeah, it looks a little worse when I do it like this. just because the different... Headmanship, you might say, like it's different brushes being applied to like the same surface material abomination. So there's the, the fiery, fiery fire fire that comes off at the top of the thing. Whoosh, whoosh. Wind chips blow us off. Buttery shade. Let's go for the lighter, more pastel shade I used for. That's totally out oh, rock crap. I'm gonna have to draw out of it, aren't I? However. Okay, that's these little segmentation thing. Oh! Still giant pencil or pencil size. Are these things joined together? Like these giant, like, uh, friendship bracelets, or perhaps croissants, or some kind of like segmented, like the kind of things kids make by putting cereal and marshmallows into a pan. It's like a at-home baking project. Yes, bake your protagonists at 450 degrees for 30 minutes. But here's one we prepared earlier. Oh! Yeah, these are a lot less impressive, I'm sure. Yeah, impressive. Okay, let's get rid of this popcorn. Popcorn? Where the hell did I get popcorn? What am I drawing? I don't know. I still don't. Okay, fine. Let's. Okay, okay, what do I do with you? Do some interconnecting tubes. Because I'm a talentless hack and just resort to the same, like, squiggly. Interconnected things, whatever in doubt. Just squiggly tubes. Yeah, I'm just like so. Oh, it's sagging. It's a coronary bypass in your pear croissant cereal life aura thing. Uh, that's a sentence. It's over here. There. Okay, fine. Uh, yeah, that's that's some kind of organ. I'm sure it like, throbs and it's what I, I don't know what it is, but I know it throbs. Um Okay, fine, that's these are clearly actual pastries, so let's get that brown from earlier, make it a little more chocolate -y. There we go. Let's make more pastries. It's, Caramelized. Yeah, sure, that's a nice pastry color. It looks nice and not nice in any way. And 
take the sure whatever bloody red colors that works out. Okay, very abstract. What the hell are you B? Fine, let's let's make something out of you. Let's just Consider this little space in a vacuum. This could be, instead of a life orb, it could be hair. This could be a face of some kind. So let's just add a just eye of some kind. Let's, let's zoom in there. It's an extra layer here of the flesh color I had before. Yeah, there it is. Default lilac color. Then okay, we'll do a pupil in here. There's not enough room for a, more than that, I'm afraid. Then the slara. There we go. We add too much. Have I ever drawn eyes that weren't just incredibly bloodshot? I don't think it- well, yeah, I have. I know I have just on like the more low effort stuff where it's just like, I've got a face made of candy! Or like that old man from Battle Network 5 that was literally just a piece of candy. Yeah, that's a uh, monstrosity in the working. Okay, so there's... Where would the other one go? This vague vicinity over here. Let's give you a very triangular eye right over here. Yeah, all right, that's triangle eye. It's, you're more like you're pyramid head or something. It's, yeah, that's it's totally pyramid head. What are you talking about? Rawr! I totally carry it face up and not drag it behind me. See, this is the thing, people celebrate my inability to, it's like, it's this inability to draw. I have this just, I don't have talent. I have persistence in the face of the lack of talent. That's what this thing is. Oh, what are you supposed to be? Fountain pen nub. Um, okay, I, I, let's just do a normal I thing right here. It's like some kind of cave painting now. That's the happiest face. Oh god, they just absorbed the eyes. There, fine. There's your happy face. Over here to the rest of the. Fine, you know, let's go with the cave painting analog, analog monologue, whatever. Get some abstract buffalo going on. It's not as funny when I draw simple little things that. God, it looks like. From this angle, it looks like he's about to shove the thing up the things. Like, just go right up the poop chute. Yes, yes. Disembowel the bull. Disembowel. What's gonna do with you? Okay. I don't know what I was doing there. Like, maybe it was like hair freckles, or no, it was like kind of like a cape fitting star chart, but. Okay, let's play connect the dots here. Uh, two, three, and oh uh, yeah, that's uh, that's wonderful. That's totally something I can work with. Or can I? Like, just turns into abstract doodle shapes. What is this? It's like a stomach. Fine, let's go with that. Let's... Fine. Stomach. Fine. Uh... Sloshy chyme, I think it's called? It's just the... Just mashed up mush of... Half-digested... Let's get that horrible green in again. And let's reconnect the... 
centipede. You're like some like human buffalo centipede thing that just attracts our one. Oh yeah, it's like uh, bulls have like bovine creatures have like four stomachs of their own. Yeah, that's totally a stomach. What are you talking about? Hell you. And a two and a three, four. Uh, okay, we can be dropping it in there. Ugh. Ugh. Hiccups? Come on, seriously, now I haven't even done anything. I've just been talking a little bit. Like spattered blobs. Like so. There we go. Now it's more like an Erlenmeyer. No, it's not Erlenmeyer flask, but like one of those like chemistry lab things that you use for boiling. It's just. Yeah, I can't tell if this is just like some. Could be a bong. connected to your mouth apparatus, so let's just reconnect your it's like the invisible man or some kind of body worlds exhibit. Oh god, if you ever saw this rendered in like body worlds like made out of plastinated human and animal flesh, this would be absolutely horrifying. Uh okay, let's yeah, this is what's that's from the mouth. That's what I was doing, but I, yeah, that's that's the brow from earlier. His his esophagus connects to his brow through his mouth. I'm not even going to ask how that works. It doesn't, quite frankly. Uh, okay, it's internal view, so let's darken that color. Uh, desaturate it a bit and darken. Ask let's just go for the opposite end of the spectrum. Desaturate. Fine. Okay. What have you been eating? That's just solid green mass. It's some kind of cucumber or pickle slosh? Maybe kind of like eating garden weeds, maybe? Maybe it's some kind of moss. Yeah, I can get behind that. Okay. Um, so are you a bong, a stomach, or what? Uh, fine, fine. Is there, you have a cave art buffalo in your hair as part of your digestive. Four stomachs, it's like the bacteria in our intestine, they help him digest. You turn the input dark green to a more vomit-inducing, uh, thing right over here, so let's... Okay, let's take it more towards the digestive croissant eyeballs over here. Past pyramid head. The happiest pyramid head ever. Uh, all right. Yes, things boil down here, so... Yeah, let's add that Bunsen burner thing. Let's get some fire going. That's totally fire. What are you talking about? Uh, okay, if it's a gas burner, it'd be blue fire. And have that, like lighter blue interior burn and then just like a little bit of orange at the base. Oh, you look horrible. Alright. So there's the tube. That weird little like gas intake valve at the near the base. And there's the actual and itself, and where's the gas coming from? Oh, well, this is a very efficient creature. Its metabolism generates a lot of methane, and it's the bacteria generate methane, and then it uses that methane and combusts it to for those digestive process. Oh crap! I'm out of time. Uh, fine, that's that recording then.